Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin for Gadget TV on Butterscotch.com, taking a look at the Sony VAIO W Series Mini Notebook. Now, you can get this device for between $500 and $600, depending where you're shopping. Now, what it is, it's a netbook computer running Windows XP, although Sony doesn't really want to call it a netbook. They prefer to call it a mini notebook. So the power switch is down here. We'll just boot it up, and we'll leave it to boot while we show you some of the connection ports that are on the device. So you see here, on this side, the left side of the device, we have a VGA port to connect to an external monitor. So you plug in the power cable, a microphone or line in, and a headphone jack here. If we have a look in the front, you can see a memory stick Pro Duo slot, as well as an SD card slot. And this is the wireless on and off switch, and also the power switch, which we just turned on. You can see here the hard drive light. Now, if we look on this side of the device, you can see the Ethernet port. This is a, a place for uh, a, no a notebook lock and two USB ports here. So you can see that it continues to boot up. We can talk a little bit about the keyboard. So you see it's got chiclet-style keys. They're actually quite comfortable to type on. The only real problem I found with these is that, um, for example, the right-hand shift here is kind of hard to hit. You f I found that I was hitting the, uh, the, ar the cursor arrow up button there, and also the tab key here. Um, I found that I was always hitting the one instead of tab. So you can see it's a pretty sharp looking computer. This is pretty standard for anyone who's ever booted up a new computer. You, you get the uh, various things trying to tell you to activate now and sign up now. We'll just ignore that for the time being. So this is a 2.6 pound netbook and it comes with a three cell battery. We'd much rather see a six cell battery but the three cell battery that comes with the device offers about a two and a half hour to maybe three hour battery life. So the keyboard is quite comfortable to type on, as I said, and the trackpad's actually uh, quite a bit better than a lot of other netbooks in its class, which we'd probably expect for the, uh, for the price premium that's attached. Now we can see a 10.1 inch monitor here. Uh, I, I believe the resolution is um, 1366 by 768 resolution. And you can see up here in the top of the bezel, there's a built-in webcam. And you can see that the computer is running Windows XP. If we go into the start menu, and we can right click on my computer to get uh, the properties. It has, uh, I believe it's a 1.66 gigahertz Atom processor inside, as well as a gigabyte of RAM. It also has a 160 gigabyte hard drive, which you can expand with the, uh, the memory stick slots that we showed you before. So you can see it's a pretty standard um, netbook computer, much sharper looking than some others in the class. You can see here the, uh, the pretty slick VAIO, VAIO logo on the top. Now, this is actually a pre-production model of this uh, series of notebook, but th the finished product will look exactly like this with the exception of this uh, sticker here, which will actually say the model number. So like I say, uh, 1.66 gigahertz Intel Atom processor, one gigabyte of RAM, the three cell battery, and 160 gigabyte hard drive. All of these are pretty standard for the netbook class. What you're really paying for here is the VAIO brand name, the improved trackpad, the keyboard, which is quite nice to type on with the couple of little exceptions that we mentioned before, and this large, high resolution and really bright uh, monitor with a nice webcam in the bezel. So that's a quick look at the Sony VAIO W Series Notebook. For Gadget TV, I'm Andrew Moore Crispin. For more sweet stuff, visit butterscotch.com.